Your time is up. Who you calling pit at? Hey everyone, I hope you're doing well. In today's video, I'm gonna be trying out one of the new perks from the new killer, The Unknown. This new killer is horrifying and comes with three new perks that are each very different from each other. While looking over these perks, one specifically caught my eye, which I believe would work amazing in chase builds. As you all know, chasing is my favorite playstyle in this game and this new perk will fit into chase builds very well. This new perk is Unbound. After injuring a survivor, this perk will activate for the next 30 seconds. During this time, anytime you vault a window, you will gain 5% haste for 10 seconds. This perk will obviously pair very nicely with our second perk, Superior Anatomy. When a survivor vaults within 8 meters of you, this perk will activate. The next time you vault a window, it will be 40% faster. Together, these two perks synergize amazingly and are an absolutely scary combo to go against. Our third perk will be Rapid Brutality. After injuring a survivor, you gain 5% haste for the next 10 seconds. This perk will tie into our first perk, Unbound, allowing us to quickly catch up to a survivor before they make a pallet or just before they vault a window. Our final perk will be Coup. After each time a generator is completed, you will gain two tokens. Each of these tokens will extend your maximum lunge range by 80%. Coup is one of my favorite perks in this game. It allows you to secure hits you normally wouldn't be able to make and will absolutely support all of the previous perks mentioned. Overall, the new killer, map, and perks are a very solid addition to the game. And for an original chapter, will definitely be a favorite of mine and many others. Thank you all so much for checking out the video. I hope you all enjoy. All right, Greenville Square. This is the new map they just added, by the way. And I've got to say, from the very few times that I've played it so far, this is definitely the best looking map in the entire game. I am a little sad that it's not fully indoor, like I kind of had hoped when I saw the teaser. Um, but it's all good, though. This map still looks amazing. Anyways, let's go ahead and teleport over here and see if we've got anybody doing anything. No, no progress on that, Shen. Nothing so far. Let's go, man. Oh, this is locked. Somebody's up here. Go ahead and break that. This guy is sitting right here. Hello. Oh, Sprint Burst Bill. Got it. Sprint Burst Bill. Dude, I've got to say, though, even though this interior building is not, like, super, super huge, the design inside of it is amazing. That arcade room looks awesome. All right, Bill's got this pallet. No worries. Go ahead and leave a remnant there. He is going to pretty much just go down here. Unlucky, man. Good try. Thought I heard footsteps for a second. I got scared. All right, I'll leave that pallet up for now. Um, one thing I've noticed, <laughs> by the way, this is the funniest loop in the entire game. Oh, shit! All right! Uh, there's a, there's an Allen over here. I just saw him. Hello. I just saw him out of nowhere. <laughs> I'll go ahead and leave. I want, I'm kind of worried on Jens over here. There's no progress. Okay, I didn't need to do that. Anyway, so the point of this build is built around the new perk, Unbound, which is going to give us haste every time we... Oh, hello. There's a ton of people over here. Uh, it gives us a ton of haste every single time that we vault. Hi, Rebecca. You have Sprint Burst as well. Oh, my God. Hi. Everybody in this lobby's got Sprint Burst. Big swing. So, uh, unfortunately, we weren't close enough to get Superior Anatomy there just because we weren't eight meters away. Oh, she vaulted again. No way. Very surprised she did that. If I wasn't dredged, that actually would have been a decent uh, decent play there. <laughs> she had distance. All right, let's head back to the uh, John over here. They actually left it. I'm actually kind of surprised. Let's go ahead and reset this. Okay, uh, let's go check on the far side. Oh, but he's there. I don't think anybody's here. Oh, there is somebody. Okay, we got Superior Anatomy active as well. She's giving up on hook. That's awesome. Love the PTB. <laughs> PTB is definitely uh, an experience every time you play it. Wow, that pallet over there looks horrible. So, uh, we have both of our perks active. The next time we vault, we'll do it basically almost instantly. As a matter of fact, I'm going to let him vault. I just want to see how quickly we can catch up here. Yeah, that's ridiculous. You can't even make that pallet back. That's so funny. Well, uh, that person's already given up. Uh, I'm not surprised, to be honest. But uh, it is what it is. Check on this shit up here. Nothing. Okay, the bill has not come back here yet. So yeah, when you pair um, Unbound and Superior Anatomy together, it does look like you kind of negate most of the longer loops with windows in this game. Like for example, I'm pretty sure, and I think I've done this before, if you vault the window from the inside of Shack, you can beat them to the pallet most of the time. And if not, then you have uh, perks like Coup to help support you on that as well. Okay, Alan, that is a unfortunate loop to be stuck on there, man. Cool, let's get this guy to a hook. I think this is his second stage. I'm not totally sure. All right, I haven't seen Bill in a second. Uh, one thing I am interested in is checking basement, but I don't think, nah. 
I didn't think they'd be down there. The new survivor has a new perk uh, called Invocation. Well, it's the type of perk. And it lets you kind of like globally put progress on generators. But it literally takes two minutes to do and it, <laughs> it, uh, it, it interests you for the rest of the game. So it doesn't really seem like a very good perk, to be honest. I got stuck. Okay, unfortunate. I'm just gonna swing normally. Do you have dead heart? No. Cool. This guy goes on hook as well. That's another gen done. All right, that was really quick. I just checked on this gen as well. Hello, Billiam. How are you doing, man? He's got sprint burst again. I'm gonna try to meet him over here if I... Oh, wait, he went down the stairs, I think. Wait, no, he didn't. Okay, my bad. Uh, well, I kind of threw myself off there. Did he drop? He did. Okay, my bad. Unhook, that's fine. Heidi's counter is gonna let us get out super early here. And I think Alan is the one we need to go for here, right? Drops the pallet, most likely. Yeah, that's a mistake. If he busts the window, I do get superior anatomy. Oh, nope, he just... He just dies. Unlucky, man. But yeah, after playing this map a handful of times now, I have noticed that many of the loops of this map are really weak. What is this guy doing? He is creeping. They're really weak. Um, <laughs> this one is just funny. <laughs> this one is just goofy. I don't understand. I don't know if this one's good or bad, honestly. A lot of the pallets are really weak in this map, but there's a lot of them, and they chain really well together. So I think that's kind of how I honestly thought he'd drop. I think that's how this uh, this map is meant to be played. You kind of use a lot of these, like, one-use kind of tiles, and then you just chain the next one. They are getting kind of crazy with the gen progress, though. I'm not going to lie. There's a bill right there. Okay, Jeff, uh, almost said Jeff. Jake is dead. And we have Superior Anatomy active as well for the Allen here. That pallet is gone. I have no idea if he is going to stay here or not. I'm going to go ahead and vault this just to get the speed that I need to catch up to this guy. And this should be a hit before he makes that window. Psych! I lied. I'm a fucking liar. <laughs> we really tried. I seem to forget that he still had his haste from uh, getting unhooked. So we were about the same speed there. I'm not going to lie. All right. GG's that guy. And let's go get the bill. And that should be game. There he is. Hey, Bill. Yeah, but overall, this map is definitely the best looking map in the game. Uh, it's definitely also one of the largest <laughs> at the same time. I don't know if they'll actually rework this map or not. I highly doubt they will. I don't really think they need to make this map smaller. Um, I have noticed, though, that there are, there are a couple of dead zones, kind of like this spot over here. But either way, GG's, dude.